After more than two decades of war, Afghanistan is struggling to build sustainable institutions that are better able to respond to citizens' needs. Afghan people are looking forward to a better future for their country. They have dreams for a better life for their children. They demand better education, better health care, more jobs, peace and development. Democracy it comes from the people. The level of the people participation is critical. And I've, I can say that in, in Afghanistan, people are eager to be taking role, looking at the previous election in spite of the risk. Afghan citizens rarely have the opportunity to directly engage their MPs. But through India's program, some MPs have begun connecting with their voters on a regular basis to attempt to address their concerns. The constituents are coming to Kabul for development projects, roads and clinic issues. They want central government and us to help them in building schools and roads for them. They urgently need clinics, especially clinics for mothers and children. It is natural that people have some needs, but we will not really know that unless we directly talk to the people. Constituents are referring to the party and the party is trying to provide the necessary response to their expectations and demands. At the same time, these constituents are referring to their MPs and are expecting them to solve their issues. It is because the people voted for them and are expecting them to have a minimum attention to their demands. Constituents are coming to our houses in a traditional way and have some expectations from us. Political parties in Afghanistan are struggling to become more representative of different ethnicities, as well as develop policies reflective of constituent concerns. While Afghan political parties have significant members, they have historically been perceived as weak or unresponsive to the concerns of citizens. Through the political parties in parliament and policy development program, India is bringing MPs and political parties closer to citizens, providing a venue to share ideas and concerns. Constituent relations require that all of the key actors be engaged in the process, including political parties and elected officials. Through this program, India has assisted political parties in developing policy agendas that respond to their constituents' needs, while testing their policies and focus groups. This helped them to organize citizen outreach efforts. By using lessons learned from NDI programs, the party is working to use those techniques and methods to facilitate relations between MPs and constituents and organize gatherings and communication programs. After the NDI policy development program, our party is paying more attention in reaching out to constituents. The party has facilitated this and it's proving very effective. The party realized that through these events, its MPs can be more successful. The need for connecting the people of Afghanistan with their representation could not be more critical in this time of transition, a need the political parties of Afghanistan recognize. In Afghanistan, political parties are mostly dealing with their own members. Since we demand the people's vote, it is important for us to hear their impression on the issues. Connecting the political parties and the parliament, I think it's one of the uh, uh, goals that this program is trying to achieve. It's connecting people, parties and parliament. The program is already beginning to bear fruit, setting the stage for not only the improvement of the individuals involved, but the future well-being of the community as a whole. I had the first group meeting last month in Badakhshan. It was a good experience because more than 2,000 people participated and were bringing up their problems and were challenging MPs. The program helped us pay more attention to policy. Therefore, following the training program held by NDI, we have assigned a technical team to develop a policy for the party. The relevant assigned team has been working on developing the party's policy.
ای کمیته الان کار میکنه روی پالیسی سیاسی حزب The goal of the program is for the people to have their voices heard and provide an opportunity to the MPs with a chance to respond یعنی مطرح کردن مسائل داغ روز Debating about heart issues of the day is very important to raise awareness among Afghan people. We are discussing these issues with ordinary people through reaching out to media and using party publications. I thought I should have a contact office in my constituency. Besides me, my party can also work from there. That will benefit me as an MP and my constituent. I can inform my constituents about what I am doing and learn about their issues. I am reporting back to them weekly. Since its founding in 1983, India, along with its local partners, have worked to establish and strengthen political and civic organizations, safeguard elections, promote citizen participation, openness and accountability in government. India is committed to developing the democratic process by helping political parties connect with their constituents and developing policies that give the people of Afghanistan a voice in their government.